For so long I put you from my mind. What are you now? A ghost? A memory? A friend? For so long I kept you at the edge of my heart, as if I told you to wait on the welcome mat but not come in. I'm still preparing the house, still preparing my heart for you. I would glance quickly away from a photo of you. If I happened to hear your voice, I would feel strange. If grief is a process and love is forever, I might never be done grieving you. And then the time came when I could see your smile and smile as well because yes, you had lived. It was easy to open the door to my heart. You walked quickly inside like you knew you belonged. I greeted you shyly, but you made yourself at home. night through the hollows and halls of my heart, the wind whispered to me you were gone. I was suddenly reminded that all of your art, I only have what is here, but you're not. I was angry at myself and at you that I let you take rent of my soul. The pain you were in, I've been there myself, and I thought I understood, but it hurts anyway to know that you saved so many, myself included, but none of us could ever save you. myself day by day every night that your soul didn't vanish from this world i still see pieces of you and the things you have left in the poetry that speaks to us all i'm not angry now although sadness does linger but it's better for us if i smile and say it's enough that he lived and he gave us so much i still notice his beauty every day if i ever forget where to look for you or if one day I wander too far, I swear I'll notice your soul in the art of this world, because art is true.